Okay, so thanks for joining me today. Today I am going to do an unboxing of a mystery box that I got from Portland Leather Goods. So if you're new to the brand, I personally have been following it for a while now, but if you're new um, or just getting started, it's so funny. There is this entire community of PLG fans, PLG for short, uh, so I'm fairly new to it. I think I discovered it within the last six to eight months, but it is this incredible company who makes different leather goods, obviously in the name. So purses, handbags, totes, um, lots of little accessories. And so you can buy directly from their website, pick out the color you want, or you can participate in buying a mystery box, which is what I did. And so I was on the fence about getting uh, my first bag from them, which I ended up buying um, from Poshmark actually, actually for my first bag. And just to kind of test it out to make sure I knew what I was getting myself into because the quality looks really great online and they have a ton of good reviews, but you know, I'm always hesitant for myself, but I will say quality is amazing. So then I took the leap to buy a mystery box from the site of the uh, mini crossbody bag, which comes with a bunch of little accessories. And so um, basically I'm going to use it for gifts and keep a little. And so I know that this is going to be a complete toss up. Um, I hope I'm not disappointed because you just never know what you're gonna get in the mystery box. So let's get started. Actually, sorry, one step back. So first I'll share, so this is the bag that I bought um, from someone else to get my introduction into Portland Leather Goods. So this is my bag here and it is beautiful. It is the medium crossbody in the color honey. And my favorite part in looking at the quality of these bags is you can really see how thick they are. So it's full grain leather and they tell you a lot of really cool stuff about full grain leather on the website and on their social pages. So I won't reiterate that, but it is amazing quality. It has a little stamp here. So fun, Portland leather goods. And my husband always makes fun of me, but I love the smell. It's, it smells like really, you know, I don't even know what fresh is not the right word, but <laughs> really amazing. Um, okay. So let's get started on the unboxing. So first of all, got my box here. This is everything. I have not opened it yet. Um, so I'm really excited and I'm really excited for you to follow along with me if you're here and interested. So first in the box, uh, it comes with this little card, Portland leather, super fun marketing. Um, and it says the leather used for our products is carefully selected and handcrafted. Any irregularities in color, shade, or finish are unique characteristics that they make this bag one of a kind. As a leather, as leather is a natural material, color fading and natural markings can show and it is not a sign of fault. On the contrary, this is evidence of the leather's organic and unique texture. Um, and then it also gives a shout out to enjoy the PLG Insiders community if you're interested. They do like this really cool rewards program where you get points, so it's amazing. And then it also lists their alias to reach out to for support. Um, like I said, I've, I've been following the brand for a long time and I really love just their customer engagement and everything. Um, oh, and then also very sustainably sourced leather um, from cows in the US. They use cows from um, the US beef industry. So giving hides that would otherwise go to waste, a second life and bonus making beautiful leather goods. Okay, so I just need to grab a drink really fast before we get started here. Thanks for bearing with me. Okay, so first bag. Again, I have no idea and I'm so excited. I hope I, hope I like what I get and I hope there's good things that are gift worthy. So let's get started. Okay, so first... Oh, this is so pretty. Okay, so here's the 
I don't know if I should do the bag first or the littles. Let's do the bag first. Okay. So everything is beautifully wrapped. I just pulled this open. Um, but I love how it's just, there's good care to packaging. Hopefully there's, it's not too scratchy with this now. Put the box down. Um, so here we go. I will open it. I took a sneak peek already, but here we go. This is so beautiful. Okay. Oh, and it smells so good. <laughs> okay. So I'm going to be very careful with the wrapping in case I end up regifting these. This is so, so pretty. Oh my gosh. I'm going to have to fix my lighting. So it's this like green, turquoise like green. Oh, there you go. There you can see the color. So again, this is the mini crossbody and it is so soft and the, the texture is, I think this is called, pe yeah, pebbly. Oh, it is so pretty. It's like, um, it's like a deep green. And oh, and the other thing I forgot to mention, if you're not yet yeah, a follower for Portland Leather Goods, um, they do this thing where oh, and the inside is so nice. Um, when you order a mystery box, you can get a unicorn color, which is colors that are amazing and somewhat rare, meaning they do not sell them on the site. So you have to, I think you can get them at the outlet mall or the outlet store in Portland, um, but not ordering them directly from the website. That's why they call it a unicorn, super fun. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna be so excited. The, okay, so here's the inside. Um, these are the littles and it's heavy so i'm i've really been hoping for a notebook i don't know if i'm gonna get it but we will see okay let me just hold this down so it is not too scratchy i really need to take some tips on how they wrap with their tissue paper it's like so well done I'm just gonna hold this to the side because i don't know if it's gonna be scratchy sounding okay No way, I'm so, so excited. Okay, so one of the first reasons why I even wanted to get, well, a mystery box because you get all the cool bags, of course, but I'm so excited. I have been wanting one of these for so long. I, think, I don't even know what color it is, but it's pretty. Oh, it's a, I think it's, I think it's black, but I have been wanting one of these little journals so much that was like the one accessory that i was hoping i would get in the mystery box i'm so 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 excited these are so fun so it has the little logo on the back and then it's like i forget what they call this but the way it opens is super cool just like a little slip and then you unwrap it and let me take a look at the. Oh, it's so fun. My husband would be laughing at me right now if he knew I was this excited over a notebook, but there, there's like the little piece that keeps it secured. Um, so if and when you fill the notebook up, you can put in replacement paper, which is cool. Um, okay, cool. I'm so excited I got the little notebook. Um, I don't. I wouldn't have picked black for the color, but I'm happy with it either way. Okay. Oops. Dropping things. Okay. Wow. That was super lucky on the fir very first accessory being the one I wanted. I'm so excited. Oh, this is cute. Okay. So one of the other little things is this little, uh, I think these are just called tassels, um, but this is so pretty. Oh, how am I ever gonna give all this away? Just kidding. I, I, I told myself I'd keep a couple things. It's so soft and this is, I think it's like a pinkish red. I'm not sure. I'm not a big PLG color person. I don't know all their colors, but it's got the little Made in Mexico tag on it. Okay, let's keep moving. Oh, I should have unwrapped this on camera, sorry. This is so, 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 so pretty. It is, what? It's like a purple. Oh my gosh. So this is used as like, um, you know, you can use it as like a little makeup bag 
or whatever you need toiletries travel the leather is so soft and it's this like beautiful shiny purple like but like a mauve and maybe it's called mauve again somebody can help me in the comments with color but it's so pretty oh and it's so soft okay you guys now i'm totally understanding why people are obsessed with these products and this brand okay that's so nice oh and there's one more so i got the mini crossbody set that comes with it's a three three by eight so you get three mini crossbody bags and then eight littles is what they're called oh this is super cute this is like so simple but it's really cute i just went to a concert the other day and this is like the perfect little again i forget what the products whatever thing is called but it's like a little mini wallet card holder and it's just this uh pretty brown again like i said i'm no expert on the colors but it's beautiful and soft and it's like a deep brown very easy easy gift okay all right so that was the first bag again this beautiful oh there we go now you can really see the color oh it's so nice if anybody loves this let me know i'm not sure what I, like i said i'm not sure what i'm doing with everything but we'll see okay now i get so excited okay so this is the second bag Again, here we go so beautifully wrapped I wonder if they if Portland Leather Goods has any wrapping videos online I'm gonna look at them for wrapping things with tissue paper oh my gosh okay I love it oh okay this is so beautiful look at the grains in that I think I think this is I want to say Cognac but I don't know. I've got to look them all up. Look how beautiful that is. And I love this one too. So this one is a little bit more structured than the last green one, which I don't know if I, I don't know which kind of like better, but I love them both. And so here's the bottom. And then again, oh, and you know what? I totally forgot to check on that last one. So some of them are zip closures. And some of them are button closures. This one is a button closure. But again, you can see the nice thickness of the leather. So pretty and nice. Oh my gosh. They just feel so good. Um, I think this style of leather is called brush. But I'm going to stop pretending like I know anything. Because I'm just a newbie. Okay. This one is so nice too. I might even like this better than my honey one. We'll see. My The other honey I bought. Okay. So now... I'm curious what that zip was on the okay yeah so on the green one it was a zip closure I know people have their preferences I don't know if I have preferences yet okay so first little coming up it's just paper oh <laughs> how silly that one was just a I think rolled up paper okay I thought it felt pretty light. That was just to help keep the bag's shape. Oh, okay. Well, just kidding. I think that uh, I wasn't counting how many littles I got in the first one. <laughs> one, two, three, four. Oh, okay. So this is all just stuff with paper. Okay. <clears throat> Not set these beautiful bags on the floor also I think isn't that bad luck okay so here is the third and final bag so far I absolutely love the first two I'm so excited about the notebook and that little makeup bag is beautiful I think I have the perfect person in mind who I can gift that to okay third one I think well, I, I think the green one is a unicorn, but I'm not sure. I'm so bummed that this is not live because I, I wish people could help me in the comments. <laughs> um, but okay, next one. Okay. So, all right. Oh 
my gosh, you all are not going to believe this one that I just unwrapped. Okay, let me, I just grabbed the littles out of here. This, I don't even know what this says, but it is so beautiful. <gasps> it is, oh, is it, oh, it actually matches. What the heck? Okay, I feel like that's so lucky. So it actually matches this. Again, I have to figure out the color. I probably keep saying that too many times. But this is so pretty. Oh, no, it got a little crease in there. We can rub that out. Okay. All right, so this is the third and final bag. And it is this incredible shimmery purple amazing bag. And it's so soft. I don't know if it would be like okay to keep something like that. I feel like I have to gift this. It is so amazing. I don't know if I've ever thought a bag was this pretty before. <laughs> okay, and this, oh, okay. This is a zip closure. Like I said, I still don't even know if I like zip or the button closure, but we'll see. I kind of want to try this one on. I don't know if that's going to be possible with the, the setup that I have here, but whoops, just making a mess. Okay, so I love this so much. So it kind of hangs, oh my gosh, in the perfect spot. And so this is much, much smaller than the one that I bought, but I actually kind of love this. We'll see like when I get out into the wild on which size works better. I think it always kind of depends, but this is a nice little like grab and go size. Okay. Wow. Always have to do the smell test. It smells amazing. Okay. Uh, one second. Sorry, awkwardly long break here while I get my bearings. Okay, um, all right, so let's see the next. Ooh, this color is really pretty. So it's this little accessory keychain of some sort. Ooh, that's a clip. Oh, that's nice. I actually have, I'm not super familiar with this, so maybe somebody can help me out. It's really cute. It's a kind of industrial looking. I almost feel like a girl or a guy could have that. Um, but I love the color. I think that is the deep blue maybe is the what it's called. It's such a pretty color. I don't know if I love the style on this one. I'm not super sure, but I love the color. Oh, it's so pretty. Okay, got a few more littles here. Okay, next one. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is like the best mystery box ever. I'm, I got so lucky. I like have been following their pages and I'm watching people post what they got in their mystery boxes. And like I said, I've been on the fence and I just, yeah, you don't even, you don't know what you're gonna get. But so this, I don't even know what it is yet, but I just, <laughs> just love the color. So it's this fun, oh, that's cute. And their hardware is even branded as well. Um, oh, this is so cute. Okay, so it opens, it has a little snap and then a zipper enclosure. This is even cuter than the little like mini wallet. I love this color, I bet. It a bag in this color would be so pretty. This is tiny, it's so cute. And I love all the craftsmanship is so good. Oops, I keep hitting my mic, sorry. Okay, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, so I've got two more left. And again, I'm completely kicking myself for just doing this recorded because 
I would ask you, oops. I would ask you, do we do this one first or do this one first? So I don't know. I'll just do this one last. How about that? <laughs> All right. So next little, oh, okay. Okay. I love this product. The color is so vibrant. It is like an orange. Ooh, it's so soft. Let me focus it here so you can see it good. For some reason, the camera is showing it a little bit lighter than it is. There we go. There's like the true orangey color. When I hold it right here, you can see the orange. This is a little bright for me. I'm much more of a cool person, but I can totally think of somebody I would give this to. This is so cute. Again, I don't know what it's called, but it's really nice. So this is the only thing that I am not in, in love with the color with, but it is pretty. Maybe in this, oh, you know what? I think I would like it way better in the summertime because right now it's like winter pretty much. So I'm really feeling all these cools. Okay. All right, this is going to be the last little. Ooh, oh my gosh. Portland Leather Goods, you're amazing. Okay, this is perfect. So is this just a little clutch? I love this. Like if you were just in a hurry, in a mood, not feeling like grabbing a whole bag to run, if you're just, you know, you just gotta go, you gotta get up and go to the store. This is, this is your piece. So little clutch. Oh, you can see the little markings on the inside from the hide. It's kind of cool. I love how they say it's like their character marks. But this is so nice. Man. Whoops. Let's see. There we go. Little zip closure. And the thing I like about this too is like it's it's pretty stiff right now. But this is such a character piece where after you've used it and handled it for a while, it's going to... I think it's going to get a little bit more flexible and then so it's not going to be so stiff to open. Oh yeah, that'll have some good give. And then, yeah, it'll probably get some nice little markings in there too. This one is so nice. I can't get over how soft this little orange leather is though. It's like, I didn't, I'm not good at describing textures, but it's, I think uh, some people say it's more of a, squ <laughs> a squishy leather. Oh, it's so soft. Wow. All right. Well, that is, that concludes this mystery box. Um, overall, super satisfied. I think the one thing I might have done different is maybe bought the mystery back, mix, mystery box first instead of buying a bag on its own just because. Um, but, you know, like I said, I really wanted to test the quality, craftsmanship, and everything before committing to buying a mystery box. But overall, I would recommend super happy with it. I think I got really lucky. I mean, I've seen some really good ones. But, I mean, from my perspective, uh, love everything. And I hope you enjoyed this unboxing with me. Again, I'm so mad at myself for not just waiting to do it live. But that's okay so yeah thanks again um if anybody wants to help me out with colors in the comments that would be great um yeah i'm so interested to know about this purple one again i cannot believe i got this beautiful shimmery purple in both this little bag and the main bag and this green is so pretty i could totally set see having a bigger bag in this too. Actually, I don't know. It's so easy to love so many colors. And this blue is fantastic too. I could see loving that. Like in the notebook. If anybody has a blue notebook like this, wants to trade me for the black notebook I got, let me know. <laughs> but anyway, I'll close up shop here. Thank you all again for tuning in. Uh, let me know what your favorite piece was or if there was something that I got that you're really looking for. Um, yeah. Keep me posted. Thank you all. Have a lovely day.